Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays with more Illusion of Gaia. Are you ready for Moo? We're not equipped. This is the um The Moo, I don't know what you call this, temple, cavern, whatever it is. Um It's a weird place. If you like weird places and weird people, me. Consider liking this video, commenting, and subscribing. I do sound a little rough, I apologize. I was getting over a cold, and the majority of said ailment left me. Um, but then it decided to come rear its ugly head with like this weird waffling of my throat. So that's not really a good way to describe it. But, you know, I'm here. I'm doing my best for you. I don't know how much of this I'm going to be able to get done today. Um, from my recollection, this dungeon is really long, so there's very little chance that this is happening in this episode. All of it, at least. I don't remember a lot of- oops. I don't remember a lot about it. So I'm just gonna take my time and get it done. As you can see, a lot of it's underwater. There's a chest that we passed in this walkway, which we obviously cannot traverse. You could consider this, I guess, the water dungeon of the game. There really isn't much to say about that, but we are going to fight these blue slime things and those weird poop monsters that you've already seen. Kind of seems very similar to the enemies we've already been encountering, so. But these guys, as you can see, you can't do much damage to them until, ooh, okay, hey, easy. Guys are just throwing their body at us. Your body, your choice, but easy there. These boys give the large jewel gem thing. Okay. Apparently this dungeon is so big. Oh! Whoa! Wow, I don't like that at all, actually. It's kind of like a heat-seeking orb. It's kind of tough to avoid. But they don't have a lot of defense, which is good, so we can just keep whacking them. You can get a quick hit on the poop monsters before they get up. Whoa. Oh, I thought he was just going to fire his doodads in a straight line. What is this? It is empty. Great. I didn't want to treasure it. Yeah, this is when the game starts to get kind of hazy. What is this? What? Okay, I'm not entirely sure what that is. That's actually pretty damaging, though. These really annoying... Grim Reaper ghost things. I don't like that. And I don't really have a way to do range damage. I don't have... Obviously, I'm not freedin'. I'm just gonna kind of. Oop. I was just gonna try to run away and wait for its sprite to despawn. There you are. I guess you can get two hits in there if you're careful. Do I need this? What is what is what is this? Whoop. Okay. This feels like this is not like a part of anything. Like this is this does not feel like this is part of the rest of like the set design. Is that all that does? Is just annoy me? Yeah, I'm getting... I'm getting whacked. Real bad here. I'm gonna be using the, uh... The despawn... Oh, you can use your... Oh. Yeah, I don't... I'm not 100% sure what the point of this is. Ooh, there's... These purple boys. A life up would be great. Okay, or that. That's fine. You know. I'm not just struggling mightily with everything right now. A life up, a health up. Nope, just clearing the way. For these little turd volcanoes. Yeah, I don't... I can't quite tell you what the value was of those glowing... Hula hoops was? 
Um, whoa! Is this uh, an alternate variety? Because they can shoot four at a time. And as the, as the game goes, do I even have any healing items? I don't think I do. Oh, I do. I have three herbs. Those look like broccoli hot pockets. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna, you know, because I don't, I don't know if I'm doing the right thing here. This dungeon is kind of sprawling and weird. Feels relatively linear though, so I think what I'm going to do is just record a decent amount of this and then hope that I did the right thing. I know that at some point we're supposed to be putting like statues inside of temples, which that might be this. The Room of Hope. It's what I call my heart. Until it gets dashed. So I think you can see enemy. Oh, there's a ton of enemies left. 25. I don't know what the force is. Oh, there's this guy again. Yeah, that guy is really getting me good. I would like to not have to fight a bunch of these things. I'm just gonna keep running because it despawns the orb. Oh, thank goodness I knew that. It wasn't a full heal though, unfortunately. Oh. Oh, I can't. I almost panicked. I was like, what do I do? And then I forgot I have powers, so we're good. Yeah, I think that's just supposed to be a bit of a, a log jam or something like that to break up the stage. I mean, how creative. You know, putting like a weird hula hoop thing in the way to stop you from being able to move. What will they think of next? These kind of look like the little weird egg things from um, whatever the alien prequel. Ooh, that was not good. I got to be more proactive and getting out of the way. The alien prequels, like the Prometheus or whatever they're called. I don't know. Yeah, I'm trying to have more self-preservation when I play this. I, I typically... You, you've, if you've been following this channel at any point in the past, however many months, years, days that I've been, that's not the order of things. That's not how time works. You know that I'm a bit, uh, a bit reckless with how I play. I'm trying to be more mindful. Maybe that's my New Year's resolution. Play less recklessly, but then also that's not fun at all. What's the point of playing if you can't just rush in unprepared, unprotected? Is this empty too? It is empty. I feel like I'm missing something. Like I'm not, these aren't supposed to be empty. But I'm I'm just gonna go and like, clear. oh boy. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I gotta fight this boy and that boy at the same time. He's not spawning down here though. Oop, there he is. Hello. I'm just gonna clear it out and then future me. Can deal with the technical side. One of my favorite things to do though when I record, especially when I'm sick, which I'm not like sick sick, I'm like recovering from sickness, but obviously I still have the uh, the residual, ooh, their, their health up. The residual like my voice sounds dumb is going and listening to myself. Obviously, I edit all my own videos. I don't hire somebody to do it because I'm a professional. So I get to go and listen to my audio and hear how dumb I sound. Okay. Well. I'm not entirely sure what the game wants me to do here. Oh, Will, I've been thinking. Thanks, Lily. This is probably like plot device. It appears as if the treasure chest is in the exact spot where the line of vision statue, the line of vision between both the statues cross. Okay, well, that's probably a sign then. Well, that would mean this. Oh my gosh, whenever it stops, like it stops the music. to tell you that there's... Yeah, thanks game. 
this game for babies. Whenever it stops like that, and it's like giving you a heads up like, hey, you, you completed the task successfully. Part of me thinks that my game is freezing and I get very nervous that I'm just about to lose all my progress. Wouldn't you hate that? All right. So just a simple jaunt back to the room of hope. A new hope. I don't know how many times you have to do this. I want to say it's at least like two or three that you're putting these. The statue of hope, statue containing hopes of moo people. He raises the statue of hope, which you don't get to see apparently. A strange whisper is heard from somewhere. I mean, a link to the past was on this system and they did show Link holding things so I'm pretty sure they could have coded Will in doing that too. Oh! Is it Halloween? This looks hopeful. The sun god Rama. The ocean holds a power. The power of pee! Be honest viewers, have you ever peed in the ocean? Okay. So... There's less water than before. It looks like we can explore new areas. Okay. Um, I'm not entirely sure. Were there, were there places in here that I could have gone? I don't know. I mean, this is geographically the closest to me. So I guess in a way, it would make sense to start here. I don't like the way this looks though. Like weird coral algae kind of grossness Ugh. is this just to clear out these enemies okay oh there's more down there great i'm not sure if there's anything that i'm really gaining from this how do i get that oh he can teleport like real teleport as opposed to fake teleporting. Yeah, I think I'm probably just going to clear this out once I can figure out how to get to the upper area that has now been uncovered by the water. What a cool gimmick. I don't know how to get there. Because I don't think this wraps around. I mean, I know that there's probably like a point. There you go, this guy. I'm gonna at least get rid of this guy. I have a feeling that there is, if I remember correctly, there's some point around here that you have to like, we get a new power here, I think at some point. I could be wrong, but that's what my brain tells me. My sickened brain. And I haven't even taken my nighttime medication yet for my brain. That makes me sound like a mental patient. I'm just taking cold medicine. You ever taken cold medicine, viewers? That stuff will get you so good. It's kind of wild how that stuff feels. Like when you take cold medicine and then your brain just... You know, maybe you're not like me, but whenever I take it and I try to function afterwards, it's like, nope. No shot. All right, I gotta avoid that guy. Whoa. Okay, so is this ramp supposed to be responsible for that entire area? Oh, we have to lower the water again. Oh, okay. Is this something that I attack? No, I don't. That is an impervious enemy. I don't like that at all. Where's that boy at? Where's that, like, Lord of the Rings ghoul? There he is. Okay, so I got, like, the double hit on him. That was pretty clutch. Gotta be careful here. Being a little too reckless. Ooh, gotta run. That was a tough... Oh, thank goodness. We can save. We can save and we can heal up. It's like the game new. It's like, hey, dummy, you're playing like crap right now. I'll give you some advice. When you start started this journey, Moo began to rise from the sea. Seawater still covers land in many places. Thanks, climate change. When the water is gone, you will discover the location of Rama, the king of Moo. 
Yes. Don't accidentally say that you don't want to you don't want to start your journey because then you just have to listen to music and give up. Alright. This was like a pretty healthy place to stop though. We're at the 15-ish minute mark, and then we'll do more moon next time. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sunday's Illusion of Guy. I'm very sick, and I will see you next time when I am well. Bye.